What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Sanchez23 with another pickup for you. Today is November 5th, 2011. Ah, oh, what a day today. Anyway, let me tell you how November 4th, 2011 started out for me. Um, got home from work about 10 o'clock. Uh, knew about the Spizike release that's coming out. Of course, that's what this video is for. You see the New York Knicks hat on, so you already know. Um, so you had the Spizike release on November 5th at midnight. You had the Dornbacher release, the child uh, kid that designed them for the charity fund. You had two colors of the Spizikes, the Miami Knights, um, LeBron's release last night, and a whole bunch of other shoes that were just randomly released from the Dornbacher series. So I had to make a decision. I know I wanted the Dornbachers from the first day I seen them. In my opinion, the Dornbacher 4s and 3s are the best out of all of them. Um, the 6s are third best, but I, the 4s look really, really nice. I mean, the detail into them, the clear bottom, the Superman logo on a Jordan, that's like, right there is worth more than enough to get. So, um, I decided I needed to get those. So, I went ahead and, uh, you know, got on the internet at 12 o'clock, tried to order them, and sold out. Uh, refresh, Nike's website crashed, all the nonsense that usually happens with Nike.com when a big release comes out. So, um, I just kept trying, I kept refreshing, I had the item in my cart, around 2 o'clock in the morning, I was finally able to order them. So I did get those, um, they're on their way, I paid the $15 for the two day shipping, which is really good because I get them by like Tuesday or Wednesday. So, you'll see a video for those guys, I'll just show you, um, here's my order. Wham! So there you go. So those are coming in. Um, I can't wait for those. Those are, those are nice. Those are real nice. Um, so those will probably ship out. Came out to like 206 with tax. Um, but the resale on those is, forget it, ridiculous. Um, so that saying, let's see what I got. Um, so let's show you the shoe for today. Jordan box. Uh, this shoe released um, very limited places, House of Hoops, uh, Champs, and a few a uh, few sneaker spots, like the real sneaker boutiques in New York City. Um, and I did not see these in any of my local spots that I usually go to, like BX Sports and a couple other stores. They weren't even aware that these released. So I was able to get them. I really wanted them. I knew I was going to get them, but it was a decision on the color. So two colors released on this shoe. It's the Jordan Spizike. And this color is the Orange Flash. Black and white. Here they are. I went with these and I'll tell you why. So the difference between these and the blue ones is just one is royal blue and one is orange. Both the same shoe in detail. Both have a clear icy bottom. This one has tumbled leather. Really one of the best quality leathers I've seen on a Jordan like in a while. This is like some genuine quality type leather. Um, you can see all the wrinkles on there. Really nice leather on here. It's all the way around the sides and the back. The blue ones are just suede nubuck. Um, they, they look really dusty when I picked them out the box, so I decided to go with these. They're brighter. They'll go better when I go to the Knicks game and wear these if the Knicks ever start playing. And um, these actually come with a pair of white laces. I like the black laces, but I'm going to put the white laces in to see what they look like. So um, let's get into some details of the shoe. So of course this has an extra pair of laces. Regular laces, nothing on the tips, nothing special about them. Um, the lace lock is pretty cool. It's got a white lace lock with a royal blue Jordan. Um, it's got orange. It's got the royal blue right here. Again, the orange tumbled leather. Best leather in like really good quality, like really stiff too. Um, then you have the new buck. You have the cement print and suede. You have the new buck suede going across here. The standard black bottom from the threes with this icy bottom going out throughout the whole bottom of the shoe. Really nice icy bottom. Um, it's just looks really nice. Reminds me of kind of like the Dornbacher threes that came out with that ice bottom. So really nice shoe. Got the Spike Lee on the back. Um, the details on the inner lining. You have all the symbols of all the Jordans lasered in, like kind of how the Jordan 20 was. Um, to me, and I'm gonna I'm gonna make this statement in my opinion, and you could agree with me if not, leave a comment down below. This is the best Jordan hybrid to ever release. Um, with the six and the five, you know, the six, the four, the three that they used, um, the five panel way, best best hybrid out pr pretty much. They've been making a lot of hybrids after this, but the Spizikes came out what like 2005, 2006, the first colorway. That's that's still one of the best hybrids ever to come out. It's still going for like three four hundred dollars. The black with the red and the white with the red and green. So 
This color, for me, was a definite cop. New York City, you already know. If you're from New York, comment, like the video. Um, if you got these, also let me know and let me know what you think about them. Here's the other foot, identical. I, I mean, I like the black pieces that they put here with the white. I mean, they put a lot of details into the shoe. The shoe is 175, as the Spizx has always been. Um, you would think a shoe that has a four silhouette and a you know a five silhouette and a three silhouette and a six silhouette would be like you know 140 to 160 price range, but I don't know. I guess the hype of them, they hype the price too. But the shoe all around is beautiful. The orange, you may not like orange, but for this shoe, it just works because it's a New York Knit colorway. So that's the shoe, guys. That's the pickup for today. Loving these a lot. Can't wait to wear these. Um, could definitely going to wear them out in the streets. These are going to turn heads like crazy. And like I said, this leather is awesome. Um, it just looks so good in person. You got to see how wrinkly it is from the, you know, the material that they used. But that's the review, guys. That's the shoe. 40 acres and a mule right there. Spizike on the back, Brooklyn. All right, so shout out to the New York Knicks. Let's get this season started already. Let's win some games. Short season shouldn't be a problem to make it at least the second or third round of the playoffs. Um, you know, everybody's well rested. So if, you, if you're waiting for the NBA to start, thumbs this up. I mean, if you can't wait, maybe you're not an NBA fan, but I can't wait. I've been playing NBA 2K12 since I got it. You know, I really can't wait for the season to get started. This is an awesome shoe, guys. If you're gonna get these, they're still out there. Um, in certain stores, I got these in 125th Street from New York. Go to Harlem, they still got them. They got them at Champs, they got them at Foot Locker. So um, you might be able to still get these downtown in Times Square also, 34th Street. Tell me which color is your favorite, the blue or the orange. I went with the orange. I couldn't get both, so I went with the orange. Um, just to show you guys, you know, that these do go for little different prices. Um, and these, these haven't fully hit the stores yet, but... Uh, you know, once they're sold out, the price will jump on them. I mean, they're going on eBay from like top rated sellers for like $250. Um, people that, you know, plus free shipping, free shipping. You're already paying $250. Don't charge me shipping. Um, $254, $259, $310, $259, $234, $300. So, very, lots of different prices, $275. Uh, so, you're going to see those go, they're going to fly. Bottom line. Um, so, that's it for the pickup guys today. I'm just curious to see what the Dornbachers are going for already. Because, you know, usually after the release, you know, a little while down the line, the price just jumps like ridiculous. <sighs> Come on. 449, 375, 480, 440, 410, 387, 250. Them shit's got to be fake. Uh, 405. Just, that's just, that's crazy. Top rated sellers on eBay. It's not even Flight Club. Flight Club probably 550, 600. Limited to only 3,000 pairs available. Um, I don't know the availability on them. That sounds probably right because it's a charity shoe. 449, guys. So if you didn't get them today, just forget about them. Same thing I did last year with the Dornbacher 3s. I wasn't able to get them and I wasn't going to pay the crazy price. Um, I wouldn't mind getting them now somewhere down the line for like 200 maybe some trades if you got them Dawn Becker threes ten and a half holla at me. So that's the pickup for today guys. Um, again This shoe is awesome This is a dope release and with all the shoes that came out today. I, I think I made out well I got my Dawn Bockers coming in. I got these and I have one more pickup to show you guys. This will be in the next video So Got these from champs today. So go ahead and check out the next video coming up today for the rest of the day Shout out to the New York Knicks. Uh, shout out to the New York people. If you're from New York, uh, my Spanish people, my black people, my white people, wherever you're from, um, hit me up, like this video, watch my videos, rate, comment, subscribe, and the next video will be coming up soon. Peace, guys. Uh, let me show you what these look like on feet, actually. So I'm going to show you that right now. Don't forget to leave your comment down below. Let me know what you think about these and if you got them or if you didn't. If you don't like them, if you do. Let's see what they look like on feet. Okay, guys, here's what them spizikes. On feet, wow, these are fresh. Just looking at them on the bottom of my feet with these jeans, these are fresh. Let me know what you guys think. Don't forget to leave a comment below. Left the white bag on there because I don't want to take it off. Here's the bottom. Icy. All right, guys, that's the Spizzix. Looking good. Tell me what you think.